myself dr harish working in medibody heading medibody clinics uh, this is an opportunity to give a basic information about the covid test basically you might have seen that there are a lot of tests people are getting confused on which test they have to undergo all these things so i would like to throw a light on this and let us have a clarity that who has to undergo what type of test so basically there are three types of tests which are going to be conducted in a covid results this one point number 1 it's an antibody test point number 2 it's an antigen test next is an rt pcr test coming to antibody test basically antibody test is not a covid detection test we should understand this very carefully because it may have come in an advertisement or the labs might have come with a publicity stating that antibody test done here what is antibody test see this is a test where it is conducted with the help of a blood or serum there are multiple ways of conducting this test there are three ways of conducting the test one is of about clear methodology second one is of elisa methodology third one is it of lifia methodology so this is basically not a repeatedly i am telling this is basically not a covid detection test this is basically to identify whether you have developed any antibodies within your this one because if you see there are a lot of asymptomatic cases are there compared to that of the symptomatic and we don't know we might have come across multiple scenarios or we might have come across with the people who are already covid and we might have also got the covid but we may be an asymptomatic just to rule out whether have we developed an antibodies for this or not this covid test this is a called as surveillance test we call it as government of india suggests that this test has to be done basically in the environment where containment zones are there or in the factories or the offices which is going to commence or for the uh, what we call public sector surveillance for these people so if you see that way there are three methods what i said in this which is practiced in our country one is about uh, rapid antibody test antibody test where a strip is taken into for conducting the test very it simple like your grb test what you are going to conduct just you have to prick a uh, drop of blood and put it into that particular uh, uh, strip so that within 15 20 minutes you will come to know what is the whether you are positive or negative for this the positive for this basically which i'll explain later on what about that and similarly there are other two methods that is clear methodology as well as that of the elisa method so there a blood will be drawn and it will be sent to the lab and there with these two methodologies either one of the methodology the test will be conducted the accuracy is basically seen in clear or elisa methodology not in lifia methodology or the strip method what i was explaining till now so what is meant by positive what is meant by negative negative means you are not exposed for covid or you have not developed any antibodies towards the covid virus positive means yes you have developed an antibody towards the covid post positive reports everybody has to undergo rt pcr test in the rt pcr test you will come to know whether at present you are having the symptoms or previously you have come across this and later on you will not be having this when is this antibodies are developed there are two antibodies which are developed basically igm and igg igm comes very soon after getting infected to the virus whereas igg it takes at least seven to 10 days to develop in our body that's why and the igg reaction to the antigens is much better than compared to that of the igm hence government of india also suggests to go for the igg antibody that is clear methodology as well as the top or elisa methodology so those who are positive for that for the first time when you are undergoing if you are positive for that immediately get an rt pcr test done then if it is a positive obviously you are suffering from covid if it is a negative it means previously you were suffering now you have developed an antibodies for that so nothing to worry about that this is the final communication which we are going to get it from the antibody test 